Lieutenant. <laughs> nah, man. Leave that shit by the door. No, 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 no. I mean all that army shit. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I think that's what you were looking for. All right. Yeah. yeah this is great. Hey, just wait a second. Here. Polystyrene. Yeah, you know, like white foam coffee cups, packing peanuts, shit like that. Yeah, got it. Hey, man. By the way, how did it go with the Wizard Island Witch? You mean Lieutenant Whitaker? <sighs> man, I thought you were going to leave all that shit by the door. That'll be all, Corporal. That'll be all. Ah, Corporal, man of the hour. Hey, D, I got a question for you. What the hell's an East Coast City boy doing all the way the hell out here? Actually, yeah. Uh, served with a guy from Long Island. Accent's kind of hard to miss. No shit, right? Let me tell you, man. Before shit went down, I used to run this website called You Need Guns? I Got Guns dot com. Oh, Jesus, holy shit. That's where I've seen you before. You had a... You had a cable show. Uh, my old man used to watch it back in the day. Hey, your old man had good taste. Goddamn right I did. I used to travel the country hitting up out-of-the-way gun shows, flea markets, shit like that. Uh, I guess this is about as out of the way as it gets. I guess it isn't that, huh? Now that's a gun. Yeah, okay. Hey, Corporal, you stay out of trouble, you hear me? Corporal? Hey, Sergeant. Been busy out there, huh? Mm hmm. That's it for now. Okay, then. Corporal, you take care now. Corporal, good. I have a job that requires your unique skills. Uh, sure, yeah, uh, yes, sir. You remember Vasquez? The man that went AWOL. Yeah, we tracked him to the logging camp, I remember. Well, this man, Sergeant Lee Anderson, was his partner. He was about to be arrested when he killed a guard and took off. Oh, your men have quite the code of honor. Our men? You're one of us now, remember? I've marked the location on where he was last seen on your map. Apparently, like Vasquez. He wasn't alone. Great. Move, move, move! Come on! You can run faster than that. My dead grandma Corporal. can run faster than that. Sarge. My dead crippled grandmother. Who is it? Mm, need some petrol, yeah? Faster than you. Moving! Yes! Sorry! Yes. Yes. Moving, sir! Let's see you, yeah. Corporal. Corporal. Keep that pipe close. Yeah. I got the gate.
Captain Corey. I'm on the side where Sergeant Anderson was last seen. All right, Anderson, let's go take care of business. No, oh, he's got to be here somewhere. Where the hell is he? This is it. All right. What have we got? Oh, God, is that Anderson with the dragon? Well, oh, how the hell am I going to get my bounty? Dead coyote lava cave. Oh, what the hell is that sound? Damn. I gotta get into that cave somehow. See if it still works. Hmm. Was about due for a flu shot. Oh, another one of those uh, micro recorders. Yeah, what are we at? We're at the designated site 301. Dead coyote lava cave. Ironically named since we're here inspecting the remains of a canis lupus mutans. Runners. Locals like to call. Hey, I've been meaning to ask one of you guys. You guys? Yeah, you know. In the research division. Uh, how'd the virus, you know, jump? You mean, how did it jump species? Yeah. I mean, we've seen it in cats, dogs, birds, these wolves. I, I didn't think it was possible. You know what viral, zoonotic, neuroinvasive disease is, Corporal? Mm -hmm, no, don't have a clue. Think rabies. Just like the hooligan virus. Rabies spreads through contact with fluids. Saliva, blood, semen. Oh, that's just gross. And while it primarily infects mammals, lab cultures have shown that it can also infect birds, reptiles, even insects. Do you know how many mammals there are in the world? A lot, I'm guessing. Yes, a lot. 5,488 to be exact, depending on who you ask. All of which, Cats, rabbits, dogs, horses, skunks, possums, foxes, monkeys, groundhogs, and yes, wolves can be infected and can spread the virus. Jesus. What's it mean? For us, I mean. Look at the musculature on this subject. The swollen and distended superglenoid tubercle. The ulnar and radial tuberocytes. A normal wolf. It runs 31 to 37 miles per hour. This guy, he can top out at 60. Yeah. And he can shoot the tire off a motorcycle while doing it. What it means for us, Corporal, is that we should be glad that most mammals are going extinct. Better them than us. Come on, let's get out of here. Yeah, better them than us.
squeeze through here. You still got your militia armband. Just gotta, just gotta go back and turn this in. It's Corporal St. John, open up. Captain, I found your man, Anderson, and you were right. He still had his militia insignia. He's dead? Well, let's just say that he had a run-in with a pack of wolves long before I got to him. That's a fitting end for a murderer and a thief. Yes, sir. Thank you, Corporal. Dismissed. Corporal St. John. Sarge. Yep, G good old high octane gasoline. C Corporal. There, Corporal. Stay safe out there. So, how long were you in the service? I mean, yeah, I miss the swearing in, but I can always tell when someone served. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, four years, 10th Army, Afghanistan. And like I told the Colonel, I hated every goddamn minute of it. How about you? Yeah, you got the eye for it too, huh? <laughs> Me? No, nothing so grandiose like you. National Guard, eight years. I actually kind of loved it, you know, pushing pencils and Salem and, and playing soldier on the weekends. But you're the real deal. Well, we all did our part. Yeah, we did it that. That is true. Mm-hmm. See you, Corporal. Keep that gun close. You know? Ah, uh, C C Corporal St. John. Sergeant. I got the gate. St. John. <laughs> uh, Wade Taylor to Deacon St. John. <laughs> oh, 
Taylor, oh, I hear a bike. Tell me you're not out in the shit tracking down that drug trafficker. Okay, okay. <laughs> I won't tell you that. But I am. <laughs> God damn it. Taylor, you're gonna get yourself killed. No, man, no, no. Hey, I followed a bunch of them up the highway. An MB7? Hey, hey, it was, no, it was, it was daylight. <laughs> the weather was clear. I didn't see a single freak. Um, but there is this, this group of, of men ended up at this ski lodge. Did you even know there was a ski lodge out here? <laughs> I didn't know that. <laughs> Taylor. It's a sweet-ass setup, too. If I ever decide to bug out, that is where I'm going. <laughs> oh, shit, I gotta run. They're, they're stopping at another camp. Taylor, out. <laughs> Taylor. Taylor, down. Damn it. Stupid kids gonna get so good. Beacon St. John to Captain Corey. St. John to Corey, come back. St. John, I've just spoken with the Colonel. He's assigned you to the research division? Captain, uh, research division, or, uh, I guess you can call it that. Uh, I'm helping Lieutenant Weaver and Lieutenant Whitaker. Good. They can use all the help you can offer. I don't know how much help I'm gonna be and just sort of their errand boy for now. And actually, that's why I radioed in. Lieutenant Whitaker gave me a requisition form that says yeast. Yeast? Hold a second. We have patrols making supply runs throughout the region. When they come across anything of potential value, they note it down. Yes. Here. The yeast and other baking supplies were noted in the kitchen area of the Crater Lake Visitor's Center. You know where that is? Yeah, I can find it. Good luck, Corporal. Curry out. Bunch of murdering assholes can't let any of them get out of here alive. There's one. Gotta finish this. Something's out here. Here! Here! How do you like killing drifters? Is that it? How do you like it now?
There's another one. I got you now, asshole. Camp's clear. Now you know how it feels, being on the other end of it, yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, where did you hide your bunker, huh? I know you got one. A hatch, yeah, here it is. Close my eyes for a bit. I was ready to go back at it.
fresh meat.
Got it. St. John to Lieutenant Whitaker, reporting in. Deacon, uh, <clears throat> Corporal St. John, yes. I, uh, got the item on your requisition form. The yeast, there wasn't much. I I'm sure that whatever you have is gonna be fine. So, uh, just curious, uh, why do you need... Sorry, I'm right in the middle of something, I gotta go. I'll talk to you when you bring it in. Whitaker, out. Okay. Another Nero injector. Good. This will help me focus. Another Nero recorder. What happened? Here? How much fuel we got? Uh, enough to get back to base. Okay. Why? Right, what's up? What are you thinking? Well, I was thinking about checking the traps over by fuel sector. Oh man, that's way out of our range. Put it on the roster for tomorrow.
<sighs> Nero injector. Just what the doctor wants. Hmm. Oh, always had trouble concentrating. Another micro recorder. One of these is gonna explain what the hell you guys are doing out here. How much fuel we got? Not enough to get back to base. Okay. Why, what's up? What are you thinking? Well, I was thinking about checking the traps over by Theo's second. Oh man, that's way out of our range. Put it on the roster for tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Sergeant, how's it going? Okay, then. That's all I got for now. Corporal? Okay. Be well. Hey, you're not supposed oh, to be Corporal. here. What's happening? Sarge. Yeah, gonna make me a quadrillionaire, right? <laughs> there you go. Well, yeah, makes sense. I'd do that if I had enough credits, you know? Huh? Ah, okay. Let's see you, Corporal. Hey, you sleep with that gun, am I right? Corporal St. John. So, man, I gotta tell you something. Okay. I knew you from before. Well, not personally, you know, but... I'm from Farewell. Same as you. And me and my friends, we used to watch you guys around town. The, the mongrels, I mean. Riding those hogs, wearing your leathers. Man, we thought you guys were so badass. Right. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, man. Had a lot of free time on my hands. I, uh, I, um, had to drop out of high school, you know. Um, knocked up my girlfriend. <laughs> had to get a job. Hey, if you ever decide to, you know, start up an MC, mongrels, whatever, just count me in, okay? I'm down. Yeah, don't hold your breath. Sure, man. Yeah, no, just, just saying. Corporal, see you, man. I think I'm gonna faint from hunger. Move along. 
along, buddy. Move along. Stop doing that, please. I'm sorry? I know that things are strange, but I can't help that right now. Well, I live in a barracks with a dozen militia assholes, when my wife lives in a private tent up on an officer's ridge. Nothing strange about that. Deacon. And the only time that I see her is when I'm done running one of her errands. Nothing strange about that either, ma'am. My yeast, thank you. Uh, are, are you baking something? I mean, if you need an oven, I know no, we're fine. No, no, I'm using it to create <clears throat> viral proteins that they, they trigger these antibodies. <laughs> but of course, you are being sarcastic. Bread, viral proteins, it's all the same to me. Hey, wait a second. Here. Thank you. You already said that. I meant for stay. Yes, ma'am. No, no. Set them over there. Thank you. Corporal St. John. This is Dr. Jimenez. St. John? Hey, Doc. This is Deacon. What can I do for you? St. John, good. I need you to stop by the infirmary. Uh, is something wrong? You need something? No, no. Nothing like that. I want to check on that arm. My arm? My, my arm's fine, Doc. <laughs> a burn like that? What do you want? From a wood stove? It's nothing to play around with. You want La Infección? You come see me. That's in order. <sighs> All right, Doc. All right. Whatever you say. St. John out. Nope. Hey, Doc. Uh, Come in. Siéntese. Have a seat. Have a seat. Mm -hmm. oh. Let's look here. So, who did you ride with back in the day? Uh, <laughs> I don't know what you're uh, getting at. No me mientas. Look, Corporal. I spent 20 years in East LA patching up bandas de motoristas and every other kind of pandillero. I know the look. And this? No kind of wood stove did this. All right. Keep it clean. It'll heal on its own. Leave a nasty scar. But I want you to come back and see me in a couple of days. You got it. Funny thing. When the city burned and the hordes came in, neighborhoods at war for decades all came together. Fought together. Latinos, Gueros, Chinos, Bloods, Crips. Didn't matter. Crazy what it takes to bring people together sometimes, no? Thanks, Doc. Taylor, haven't heard from you in a while. I was afraid that maybe you'd gotten too close to that man you were tracking. Oh, I'm close, all right. I'm right in their friggin' backyard. Hey, I need your help, man. I'm, I'm at, the, at a small camp south of Crater Lake, just off the South Rim Drive. 
Taylor, listen to me. I have no idea what you're doing, but you got... Oh, shit! No, no, no! no. Let me go! Hey! Oh. Taylor? Taylor! Oh, damn it! St. John to Lieutenant Whitaker. Come back. Switching to a private channel. Hold on. Deacon, are you there? Yeah. Uh, hey, so I, I looked at that requisition form. It says that you want silicate? Yeah, silicate. I use it as a distilling medium in the column chromatographer. Oh, column chrom... what? <sighs> Sorry, it's just... it's the one part of my research that's actually going well. So, silicate, where do I get it? Oh, shit, I thought I marked it on the rack. Hold on. Let's work. Okay, there's this little general store southwest of us near Mazama Village. You should be able to find it there. Okay, got it. Thank you. Sorry, never mind. <clears throat> Carry on, Corporal. Yes, ma'am. Uh, Lieutenant. Sarah, out. Silicate. What the fuck is silicate anyway? John, this is Captain Curry. Come in. Yeah, Captain. I'm here. Well, I just wanted to let you know that the Colonel gives an informal talk every day at dusk at the staging area where you were sworn in. Uh, yes, sir. Though all these talks are informal, enlisted men and women are expected to attend. <clears throat> uh, copy that, sir. Curry out. Great. Commander likes to give a fireside chat. Can't wait. channel. Deke? Okay. I want you to know that I meant what I said about... about you staying and helping. I know this can't be easy for you. Being here like this. Hey, uh, where else am I gonna go? And if I leave, they're gonna make me give back this really cool hat, so I'm starting to like this hat. I mean, really. Okay. All right. <clears throat> I gotta get back to work. This yeast has already filled up like half a dozen petri dishes. Okay. Save me some of the viral proteins. I got an appetite out here. I'll do that. Lieutenant Whitaker out. Captain Corey, this is Corporal Russell. Come in. Move back, damn it. You heard him! Pull back! Pull back! Russell, report. Sir, we were on a supply run trying to get the Shemult, and we ran into the biggest goddamn horde you've ever seen! Damn it! Move your asses! Come on! Move! You heard the corporal! Now, corporal, listen to me very carefully. Get your men out of there. We are not ready to engage. Do you copy me? Yes, sir. You don't gotta tell me twice. Russell out! Come on, move it! Let's go! We're pulling out! Let's go! 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 Corporal St. John, are you there? I need you to report to me at command at your convenience. Colonel, of course, sir. St. John out. 